Hello guys, how you doing? You are back me Daza and we are doing a food review! Back to the bread and butter. Uh, this is where we started back in the day, almost almost a year ago. Fuck me. So this is almost a year ago we've been doing this bad boy stuff. And uh, people have said, I like the, like the vlogs and like the other things are doing, all this different thing. But I would stick to the reviews and do you know what? You're absolutely bang on. Today, I didn't have lunch earlier on. It is quarter past two. I'm having a late lunch and I am having a... Pot pasta, pot pasta, a uh, creamy carbonara flavour. Look at that. So, what's he do? Oh shit! Oh, oh that's good. That they're tiny wee spirals and they've been up to big ones. Um, what you do, right? Is this is a, I've never seen a pot pasta before. Now you know I've seen a pot noodle before. I had the green curry one not long ago. So, what you do is you boil the kettle, obviously. You pour it in, obviously. You put the lid back over it again. Don't take the lid fully off. And you put it back over again, let it sit for five minutes. But in those five minutes, you're meant to go and check out at Potnado. Well, I'll stop you right there because I have not checked out at Potnado. What I've been doing is making TikToks. Right? Sad as it is, I said I wouldn't jump on the bandwagon and start doing them. But see this isolation stuff? It has been absolutely mental. Been in the house for a long period of the day. And I thought, do you know what? Tell with it. If you wouldn't get a bit of enjoyment out of this, a bit of a laugh out of it, then go for it. So that's what I've done. So I've got a TikTok page at Dazza Does 19. Go give it a look. I've got 112 followers, right? I only had about 30 yesterday. Done a few TikToks and went down not too bad. Um, I don't know if I can show you them because I might get I might get done with them. Um, copyright or something. There's a few. Like, there's a few to look look through. So we'll have a swatch. Have a wee swatch for us guys. Give us a wee follow. Thank you. So we're going to have a pot pasta. It was a creamy carbonara, right? It was one pound thirty nine dish. Uh, and I where did I get it? Don't even know. Forgot it. it was a long time ago. Um, what well, I've also thought as well, I'm not going to shave my beard. I'm going to let this grow and grow and grow and grow. I'm keeping the beard. I'm going to let it grow out. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing with the, the, the hair. It's getting a bit of a state. What I was thinking of doing is like shaving it back inside, but letting the, the top grow and grow and grow and just have it like a pure gimp. Creamy carbonara. There was another flavour beside it, but I don't know what one it was. Again, I forgot. That's what it looks like. So it looks kind of similar to the Lloyd Grossman. Right. So it's almost similar to Lloyd Grossman, like it's, it, does, it does not look anywhere near it does in the thing. It looks like a creamy sauce, this is a wa very watery sauce. I'll get a mix through. Um, I've yet to see a bit of ham. Oh, that's horrible at the bottom. Oh, you need to get good stuff through, right? Back in a minute. Right guys, so if you get this pot pasta or any of these pot pastas, all this stuff's at the bottom. They've got the cheese, uh, it's looking more creamy now, right? Fair play, that's not bad. Um, all your cheese and ham is at the very bottom and it's like kind of powdered cheese and crap like that. It smells very cheesy to be fair, right? What we need to do is we need to give that a wee minute to... Oh, that's definitely fucking cream right up. So, see what it was before? Look at it now. More creamy. Happy day. Happy days. Um, need to bit of look horrible. So I'm just going to grab a wee bit if I can. Blow on it, let it cool down. Mm. I've just hit the two bits at the bottom of rock hard. They're crunching everything. I didn't hold that much hope for this. I thought it was going to be very similar to the, the Lloyd Grossman pasta I had, and I was fucking rotten, absolutely rotten. But that sauce is quite nice. Once you get a mix in and it thickens up, I mean, look at that. I know it's a bit I don't let the kids on, right? It's very drippy, but see, you see it compared to what it was. It's almost like a, a cheese sauce base. It's not bad. Fucking, that's not going anywhere. That's gonna have to start paying, mate. Right. Yeah. That's really nice. That is really, really nice. Wow. Didn't expect that. It almost tastes. What's the, the cheesy pasta you get in the red box, the wee red box? For like a pound, it almost tastes like that, but just creamier. With ham in it, we haven't had a bit of ham yet. Biting in there somewhere. Um, so I'll wrap it up, right? I'm gonna do another one in a minute anyway. Pot pasta for me. Pot pasta, creamy carbonara. It's gonna get a solid <gasps> eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. I, I thought it was gonna be at least maybe a four. The it just blew me out the water. It's amazing. It's only one pound thirty nine, so give it a wee go if you can get it. Uh, would I have it again? I would, but I'd let it sit longer so all the pasta cooks through and it's not crunchy like I'm getting it now. So, 8 out of 10, 
I'll have it again. So guys, I hope you're all den den oh, I hope you're all getting on fine with the coronavirus isolation. Hopefully not too long ago, guys, but we let's just stay safe, let's stay sensible, and I'll see you all soon. Cheerio!